Hello everybody and welcome back to the Dragon Quest IV Let's Play. I'm your host, Saigon. If I recall correctly, now this was a week ago that I last recorded, uh, we got the mod rod? Maybe? Somewhere. There it is! Okay, cool, we do have it. Um, we are rocking some fishnet stockings on the hero. Let's move those. Uh, not Elena. Elena is wearing the bandana. Did we not equip her with the pink leotard? Was it not as good as the spangled dress? Did we just hand it over to her? I'm sure I heard about that. Okay. Well, we can do that. Alright, miscellaneous. Organize items. Everybody. Sort bag contents. Order by type. Yes. Alright, we're all sorts of organized now. So today... I'm sorry, this is kind of a, a wonky intro. I'm all sorts of distracted, because... I kind of had to force myself to play this. I've been playing a lot of Neo Geo games lately, and that's just kind of been occupying my mind. But I need to record more DQ. Uh, today we are going to Riverton, which is going to require a bit of sailing. Oh, wait. Elena. No. No, that's not what I wanted. Damn! Where'd that leotard go? Oh, okay. It's not as good. All right. Well, fine. Whatever. Okay, so what we're doing is we're going to Riverton today. And that means sailing, and that means finding a good place to sail from. Minikin's Dominion seems like as good a place as any. I don't believe it's actually close at all. Nope. Nope. In fact, it's... Well, here's what we'll do. We'll swing up around the Cape and then head north. Because the world is round! Yeah, that's not too bad. There's probably a better place that I could have gone to. Like, whatever this town is up here to our north. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Kirill, I don't trust you. <laughs> Just stick to regular attacks, please. Thank you. We're actually, we're kind of approaching the end of the game faster than I thought we would be. DQ4 is actually much shorter than uh, some of the other Dragon Quest games. It might even be a little bit shorter than 3. Alright, here we are in Riverton. An annoying town to navigate, because we have to keep getting in and out of the boat. Meow. Meow. Meow, meow. Uh, Battle Axe. No. Dream Blade. No. Dragon's Bane. No. We are still good to go. Nothing back there? Really? I guess that door is just there so he can let himself out. I can't believe... I actually have all these items that I need, or all this equipment. Like, I'm actually a pr prepared equipment-wise, and it's just shocking to me, because that's not normally the case. Well, I guess we'll just throw some herbs in the bag. Whoops. Not, not one. God damn it. Fine. Go in the bag. Because those do come in useful from time to time. Are you going to make me sail to you so I can speak to you, sir? I guess. We will want to come back here at night. People reckon there's a monster castle somewhere in the Ostro Outback. 
No one's been enough of a gala to go and find out if that's true or not, though. Haha. <laughs> There's a seed of life that we can get here if we come back at night. Which will probably just go immediately to Borea. So he doesn't get murdered constantly. Mini metal! Back in the old days, people used to fly about in the sky in funny contraptions they built. But that all ended when the Lord of the Underworld went and made off with the basic ingredient, if you like. I reckon it probably ended up being sealed away with him, you know? scary fight. The Lord of the Underworld. Can I not? Oh, there we go. Any armor that we need. Negative. Still negative. Also no. Nope. 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 I don't know what to do. We have all the equipment that we need. Traveling around the world, are you? How'd you like to stump up for me flying machine to help you on your way then? There's only one slight problem. I ain't finished it yet. All I need is a gas that's lighter than air, though, and then I reckon she'll fly. Well, that's the trick, isn't it? But that is our, um, our miniature goal for this point of the game. Build a flying machine. So, the main ingredient for the flying machine, which is probably this mysterious lighter-than-air gas, was stolen by the Lord of the Underworld. God, I wish there was a setting that you could just have all items immediately go to your bag. Hooly dooly, I could hardly believe me eyes, you know? There's a humongo statue to the south of this river in Struth. I swear I saw it go walkabout. Fair dink. I don't know what that means, lady, but, you know, whatever. Ooh, gold bracer. Hmm. Borea, I'm thinking. <laughs> oh, no, he's got the Ruby of Protection on. That's even better. Uh, it's not as good as the fishnet stockings. Drop her. I want to put it on Kirill? I want to put it on Kirill. Were you sleeping on the job, sir? Oops. And then I walk out. God damn it. <laughs> Now we have to watch this again. Nope. We're good. Thank you, though. Okay, so, first... Let's go outside. We're going to go outside, we're going to make it nighttime, we're going to get grab that seed of life. Oh, come on. How do you want me to... There we go. <laughs> Parking a ship is not easy. Boom. Seed of life. Let us give this to... Yep, Borea needs it the most. Meow is a question. Like, hey, who are you? Check out this center island, and then we'll probably just go and stay at the inn, make it daytime, and continue on our way. Do you have anything new to say? No, you don't. Thank <laughs> you. 
quit sleeping. Is that all you do all day? Don't you have, like, paperwork? Balance the books? Something, man. What are you doing? Clean the sheets, maybe? There's a lot of work to do as an innkeeper, and this guy is just really phoning it in. And then he has the gall to charge 80 gold. Oh, right, there was a cave right there that we didn't check out. Uh, south of here is the Colossus statue. Statue? Statue, mate! <laughs> I'll be stuffed. I didn't think anyone would find me here. This is my secret fishing spot, and I'd like to keep it that way. Don't tell anyone, right? Right. Oh, it's not even a proper cave. It's just a tunnel thing. Alright, carry on. Keep on fishing. We are going to continue onward to the Colossus. There it is. Gate there. Here's the Colossus itself. Let's check out this little hut. What's in here? Oh, it's a priest! Can we save? It is said that the Colossus catches the teardrops that falls from its eyes. Good luck on your quest, my children. No, I guess we're not saving. I didn't see a priest in the in Riverton either. Oh well. All right, so what is going on up in this dungeon? Doesn't look like too terribly much on this floor. Well, there's a treasure chest over here, so let's go grab that. Oh boy, voodoo gurus. I kind of feel I could switch Kirill out of the group and bring, like, Ragnar or somebody. There's no boss in here, I don't think. Yeah. Yeah, we'll leave him in. Could swap him out for Mina. Let's do that, actually. I know, oh, that's right. I remember these guys. I hate these guys. Them and the hippos. The hippos with the big shields. <laughs> Elena, why did you attack the one that's all beefed up? God damn it. Damn it, Elena. And she saps the wrong fucking one! <laughs> oh man, it's awful! Maybe now we can make some progress. Some incredibly, incredibly slow progress. But progress, nonetheless. You attack, you... 
I'm curious. Let's let's try it out. We'll give it a shot. Alright, maybe we'll keep Carol in the group for those guys. I don't know anymore. I don't know what I'm doing. We'll just we'll heal up and we'll go back in. We have Kirill to cast whack on the stupid rhinos. Whatever. Just so annoyed. Alright, what do we got here? We have a treasure chest and... Stairs. Some money. Still don't really need it. Thank you, Maya. Alright, we're back over here now. Is there a treasure chest over there? No, there does not appear to be. Let's go upstairs. Man, it is so nice being able to turn this camera so, so nice. Ooh. 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 Elena. Be a bit faster, please. There is a meteorite bracer in the game. That'll probably wind up going on Maya for um, bee dragon metal slime hunting. That's my thinking anyways. Yeah, Kirill got full heal. Fantastic, fantastic. Kirill just got a little bit less useless. I pick on him too much. Some hell lions. All right, you go ahead and try whack again. Just try it out. Boom. Damn, Elena. <laughs> I guess whack w really only wanted to work the one time that we needed it. Black works only when we want alliteration. Yeah, I'll try it again. It's not like you're gonna kill it with a regular attack. Yeah, crits! It's my girl. So we have some sort of room here. Probably go inside, check it out. Well, that's curious. 
doesn't seem that you can actually go anywhere in it. There's stairs on the other side, though. Oh! Oh, it's the Halo Hammer. All right, so the Halo Hammer is a miss or crit type weapon. It's cursed, but yeah, the curse is that it misses like all the goddamn time. But when it does hit, it's a guaranteed critical. It's all right on Ragnar for hunting slimes with. Aside from that, I'm not a giant fan of it. Aha! No! No! It's the worst thing ever! It's a mimic! No, 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 no. No, God damn it! Stop it! <laughs> Shit! Oh, it's not fair! It's not fair! I hate them so much. God. Stupid fucking game. <laughs> Treasure chest was empty, much like the heart of a mimic. Interesting. How do we... So those are the eyes. Ground followers, you... Journal Mercy. Ouchie. stairs that go up, but how do we get... Oh, are we going down to those later? We'll figure this out. We'll figure this out. Don't fall. No! Dicks. Oh! Oh, okay. Alright. Alright. It's all good. It's all good. It's all good. We need to jump out of the other eye. Do, 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 do. See? The Colossus catches the tears that fall from its eyes. Ah. Gotta appreciate a cleverly worded hint like that. That would be an ear, I'm guessing. Pull the lever, Kronk! The statue of the Colossus starts to move! Hooray! Let's pop out.
And there we are. We're on the other side. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. This was another episode of the Dragon Quest IV Let's Play. I am your host, Saigon. If you're enjoying Let's Plays, please hit like and subscribe. And if you're enjoying the look of Dragon Quest, uh, please remember to support this series. It needs all the support it can get. <clears throat> uh, be that picking up Dragon Quest Heroes or um, picking up some of the mobile ports, which are... Almost all excellent. DQ8 is the only one that's not really quite as good as the console uh, release. So, that's that. Take care, everybody. Have a wonderful day.